having an amazing day today. I hope you had a fantastic Christmas. Um, obviously, it wasn't the same as usual, um, but I hope that you managed to make the best of the situation and have somewhat of a nice day. Um, and for me personally, it was really lovely just to see kind of my mum, dad, brother, grandma, absolutely lovely. It was so lovely. So I feel very grateful that at least I was able to do that. But today, <laughs> I thought I would do something that, um, so something that I really enjoy. It's probably my favourite kind of video to watch on YouTube is um, what people got for Christmas. I know it's a weird one, <laughs> but for some reason... I absolutely love watching that kind of thing, so I hope that you will as well. <clears throat> I would say, grab a drink, grab a snack, <laughs> light your candle, get relaxed, because this is probably going to go on for a, a little while, <laughs> we'll see. Um, and if you're not already subscribed to my channel, please subscribe, um, I would absolutely love that more than you could possibly imagine. It would be the best Christmas present in the world, <laughs> so my... Um, aim for 2021 is to really build my Instagram and YouTube. I've only started them very recently, so um, that is what my sort of aim is for 2021 and what I'm going to focus on. So I would absolutely love for you to go over to my Instagram as well and also um, be part of my YouTube community. So thank you very, very much. First of all as well, I'm wearing my um, last Christmas as a miss <laughs> because we were meant to be getting married in November um, 2020 obvious reasons got cancelled um so we are postponed till next year so <laughs> we got this um hoodie as a reminder so last christmas is a miss um and hopefully we'll give, be getting married june next year so fingers crossed keep everything crossed for us so let's get straight into this video first of all i want to say as well i'm not doing this to brag or anything like that it's just something that i like to watch personally so i thought it was something that hopefully you guys would like to see as well so i'm going to start with um what dean got me for christmas so this is the cutest this is from um primark and it is if you know me you know i love loungewear and this is just a massive oversized kind of like boyfriend jumper which i'm obsessed with um it's in a size medium but they really they come up absolutely massive and i love stuff like that so i felt very grateful for that one pop that there um the next thing he found um in i believe it was the it's bad that I know all that <laughs> um, present, but we this year because obviously it's been very difficult and I had to close my other business down during Corona. Um, obviously, money wasn't huge, so we kind of um, you know usually maybe we go way too overboard. Although I feel like we probably did this year as well. But <laughs> um, found this in the Black Friday sale and it is a gorgeous again boyfriend size. I love that kind of oversized. Um, Bit nice and cozy that you can wrap up in um this is the jack wills kind of such a nice hoodie isn't this so nice like the colors with the pink piping and the navy and the baby blue it's absolutely perfection so that will um be very very used so that was lovely and then i got he also found um a little calendar because as he knows that I'm obsessed about my mindfulness and yoga and everything like that he found a calendar which is so cute and it's got all of kind of every single month there's different um kind of mindfulness speeches as it were um on there so that was I love that that's really thoughtful that means a lot he knows me well <laughs> also some little um cozy socks with little sort of koala bears on which is just did I try and say that in a really odd way? Koala bears? <laughs> I can't do accents. <laughs> um, but little koala bear sort of totes, which are, is that how you say it? Totes? Mm. But they are lovely. I also got <laughs> um, running joke, because obviously, because I um, have, um, I never know how to pronounce it, but it's called Ellis Dallas syndrome and basically um i've got sort of like over um movable kind of joints things like that so i tend to get quite a lot of chronic pain and therefore sometimes i have to have kind of medication but not that you want to know blocks me up a little bit <laughs> so so dean wrapped me up some um constipation relief so <laughs> i love it but i love stuff like that. practical that's what you want from a christmas present practical so <laughs> um also got me um because we do stockings as well so some of these are stocking presents and, and we kind of like merge them so we both do a little stocking it's just something to sort of 
cheer us off at the end of the year. So um, this is a little um, honey foot pack, which is perfect. I love stuff like that. So that's perfect. Um, also a little kind of, you know, like little note notelets, things that you can kind of like pop on and it's got all the dog breeds on there. So that makes me extremely happy. It knows me so well as I say. The same with this, like a little doggy journal so I can write all my YouTube videos and um, sort of what things I'm going to do on my Instagram and all of that kind of thing. So I'm ridiculously excited to crack into um, a new journal. Sorry if you can hear the dog scratching at the door, they're desperate to get in. But if I if they came in here, they'd be stealing everything, especially the next thing that I'm about to show you. Which <laughs> so basically, um, my dogs have an obsession with underwear or socks. And so they literally rip them apart. And I do not have a single pair of underwear that isn't, um, they just can't be used anymore. So, so bless Dean, he went um, on Victoria's Secret Online and got me a million types of pants, which are absolutely stunning. And there's lots of them. I, lots of them. <laughs> So I can throw all of my old ones away and they're really pretty because they have all kind of like, I don't know if you'll be able to, you probably won't, but they've got sort of like glitter sort of through them, which is oh, absolutely gorgeous. So I cannot tell you how excited I was when I opened these. <laughs> so I can throw all my horrible bitten pants away and I can have some nice fresh new ones. <laughs> so just um, lastly in that one, he found a lovely little um, jewelry book. As I said, I'm sorry, this might go on for a while. I'm not sure how long I've been filming so far. Oh, seven minutes. Um, I've got quite a few to get through, but um, as I say, grab yourself a nice sort of drink and um, snacks and then we can, um, we can get through this together. So a lovely little travel jewelry box because next year, hopefully, let's be able to go to a few places. So that's adorable as well as um, another, so I believe these were from B&M, another kind of a lovely kind of um, blush pink, which is what my sort of office area is. That's all the color scheme in there. <clears throat> and these, I was watching um, someone on YouTube um, and loads of people raved about these that are available on Amazon. And they're just a lovely pair of massive sunglasses. I mean, it's not gonna, I can't really wear a hoodie and, but, they are just gonna be absolutely gorgeous for this. I cannot wait. I lost my favorite sunglasses in the world. And so these are gonna come in very, very handy. Um, really affordable and really nice quality. Like they're just so lovely. So excited to wear those. <clears throat> so let's go on to, oh, actually no. <laughs> the main present that Dean got me, which I was overwhelmed by. So basically he, we did all of these presents and I was, overwhelmed I was so I couldn't believe it and then he said there's one more present and I could not get over it <laughs> I think I teared up because for ages I've been wanting um but I could never justify the price the Samsung earbuds light they are incredible and at first I for about an hour I was trying to fit them in my ears and I couldn't fit them in and I thought oh my god this is the worst like well not the worst but <laughs> you know what I mean and I had to watch YouTube tutorials on how to actually put them in and now it's very easy so it's just me being stupid because um, <laughs> I'd never had ones like this before so I've got these I can't wait they're gonna be perfect for going on the dog walks um, so unbelievably grateful for that so that was Dean's amazing thoughtful wonderful gifts so Dean's parents again I I couldn't be more happy <laughs> so it is the spectrum and um, Disney collection of brushes so in here it did come obviously a lot nicer but I've been messing around with it all but it comes with all these pastel colour spectrum brushes which are absolutely look how beautiful they are like oh just comes with every single like all the pastel colours absolutely stunning um and in this wonderful sort of um pastel coloured rainbow case which is going to be perfect for again traveling if we can <laughs> so I was overwhelmed with that absolutely I could not have a more perfect present so that was stunning so that one and Dean's man 
was incredibly thoughtful as well and found me a, because again, as you're probably aware by now, I'm obsessed with dogs, so <laughs> got a 2021 doggy planner, which is absolutely gorgeous and it's great because they are full days in there and I am <laughs> going to be extremely busy next year so I need full days to be able to um, <laughs> plan everything, so that's amazing, love the colour, love everything about that, that's really, really thoughtful. And as well, this lovely little makeup bag with A on, I think that's gorgeous and this is holographic with the um, sort of rose gold or blush pink. Oh, I love it, it's so thoughtful, I love when it's just like the thought that goes onto it means the absolute world. So Dean's um, lovely, lovely sister and partner and lovely little Phoebe, um, my technically sort of niece um as soon to be when when me and Dean get married she will obviously be um, my niece so she got me um loads of bath stuff but I will be honest with you I used most of it last night I ran myself a bath used um the bath bomb the bath salts um the face mask everything that she bought so <laughs> they're all in there and it was so so thoughtful so that was really really lovely I'm sorry I haven't got those to show you it was that one and then we'll go over to um I believe my mum's let me Actually, I'll do my brothers first because that'll be <laughs> So, um, also in the comments, what was your favourite, if you did gifts this year, what was your favourite um, gifts that you got? Again, I, I'm i very aware that I don't want it to seem like in any way I'm kind of like, oh, look at all these things I had, and, you know, be spoiled in any way because honestly, cannot tell you how grateful I am. It's been a tough year and... I personally enjoy giving a lot more, and I'm not just saying that, but the joy when we were around the table and I was giving out, it was amazing. But obviously I know how lucky I am for all of these wonderful gifts. So I just want to sort of like put that out there first before I <laughs> carry on. So my brother got me my favorite artist um, and he does like all the Disney prints and everything like that. And so here's the artist name. I can never pronounce things so I think I'll just put it there. <laughs> and um, so the first one that he got me, the first print, so this is the one, the Cinderella, Cinderella Castle, because obviously me and Dean, well not obviously, but me and Dean got engaged outside um, the Cinderella Castle, so it's really everything to me. My grandpa's favourite place in the world was Disney, um, the same as my family's, so we've been there so much and it's a very special place in all of our hearts. So my brother gets me he's got me two others of this which I'll show you one day but um so he bought this one to go with the collection and uh, yeah I just love collecting them and they are beautiful and he's an incredible artist I've got so much I've got all his like sort of cottages that he's done he does all the Disney prints everything like that and with that um my brother also got the calendar which is stunning and my favorite being um sorry I don't want to bore you with Trying to flick through to the... You're not even going to be interested, but I just want to show you because I love it. Oh, look at this. How cute is this? Oh, oh. <laughs> absolutely amazing. So I was overwhelmed with that. Also got me a big tub of sweets. But that's at home in my dog grooming salon. Um, at home at my parent... Yeah. <laughs> in a dog grooming salon ready for me to eat in the new year. So absolutely again incredibly thoughtful incredibly wonderful gift so very grateful for that um in this bag as well my um auntie who lives in dubai um auntie and uncle bought me like i honestly again i don't ever cry but i was tearing up i could feel it at the back of my eyes um <laughs> oh this it could not be a more wonderful present but the um charlotte tilbury um i don't know whether this was meant to be a sort of advent calendar something like that I, I believe but obviously it's a little bit different because it doesn't have numbers on so it, it was probably something like um one of their kind of advent calendars but how gorgeous is this with the kind of um faux sort of crystal doors I think that's absolutely beautiful and I definitely will be reusing that maybe for jewellery or something like that but in every single one of these there's like the most gorgeous products I oh let me just tip that <laughs> so I mean for example, like just all of them are just so gorgeous and it's something that personally I wouldn't particularly be able to afford at the moment, Charlotte Tilbury particularly, um, but obviously such wonderful products and some of them are kind of like full size and I mean I'm so excited to try these all out because here's like the highlighter um, and I'm just incredibly, something where you get this gift and then there's lots of other gifts inside, it's just, oh I was so excited kind of opening all of those and I can't wait to try them all out with you as well, so that was an incredible gift, um, let me pop that down there. 
So very grateful for that again. Um, then we'll go on to my mum and dad's um, Christmas presents. So got me some cute, again, I think these ones were in the sale from next last year, um, but she always gets me some like really cute Christmassy pyjamas, so this one has a little pudding on, which I wore on Christmas day, and it says pudding up with it, <laughs> which is basically sums up this year really, doesn't it? Um, so there's those with the lovely um, cute little pudding trousers, how adorable are they? Really nice and comfy, nice big waistband so I could eat as much as I wanted, and trust me I did. <laughs> So, there's those ones, let me pop those down there, and then she got me some, oh, a couple of diffusers, so, um, at when I ever go home, um, I always, I'm literally five minutes away, so, <laughs> but when I go to my parents' house, in my old room, um, they sort of redid it all to look absolutely amazing, and they, Every time I go in it smells absolutely incredible and it's this Ted Baker um, diffuser and honestly it is the most amazing smell, it's really strong because you know you get some and it lasts like a day, this lasts for, like absolutely ages and it's absolutely gorgeous so she got me um, a diffuser and also a peppermint grove diffuser as well, um, this one is sugar shortbread, oh Oh, I can't wait. So I'm obsessed with things like that. Um, <laughs> anything like candles, diffusers, anything that can kind of get me feeling nice and relaxed is perfect. So um, also got me, let me just, <laughs> so she popped it in this little um, bag. I got lots of little bits in here. So it's things like um, some sort of, you know, like bath soak, which I, I have, at the moment, have a bath pretty much every night, so <laughs> that's absolutely perfect. Um, also got me a load of um, Pixie skincare. So Pixie skincare is one of my favourite um, brands of skincare. That, brilliant for my skin, so obviously everybody's skin's different, but I could not recommend you to try this. It's, I could not recommend, that doesn't make sense. <laughs> I highly recommend that you give Pixie a go because she got me some face masks, some eye cream, um, all of those kind of bits. The serum, which is absolutely brilliant as well. So ooh, that one there, I don't know if you can see that, but this is, oh, does wonders. When when I ran out of this, my skin just changed again and it wasn't great. Whereas using these, I could not recommend highly enough. Um, also we've got the hydrating mist and that, which was so lovely because it was to open it up and then there's all like little presents in there. It just honestly makes my heart melt. I felt very lucky. So um, that's all in there. So let me pop that one. Oh, see, I've got too many little things that I, <laughs> I'm so lucky. I feel really, really, honestly, overwhelmed, grateful. I sit there on Christmas Day and think I just, yeah, feel so grateful. However horrible this year has been, I mean, I just sat there feeling so lucky of the situation I was in, you know, and um, fully aware that other people will be in a lot of a sort of much different situation. You've always got to remember that in life. I put that on Instagram, that there's always going to be someone in the world. It doesn't matter if you're you know, maybe homeless or something like, you know, and it doesn't matter where you are, there's always going to be someone wishing that they had what you had, um, whether that be clothes, whether that as in just, you know, having a warm jumper, whether that, you know, in my situation, people would do anything to have, you know, their own house, their own car, it, whatever situation you are in life, there's always going to be someone that was wishing that they had what you had. So it's always trying to remember to be incredibly grateful for what you do have. Um, and so, yeah, I, sorry I won't go on about that but <laughs> bring the mood down but no it's just to you know remind you to always there's always something that you have that someone else wishes they did so always to be aware of that so another little box and inside again there was um things like the Elemis um bath like sort of bubble bath um because again absolutely love baths <laughs> um just a few Elemis products so I was incredibly overwhelmed with that as well because Elemis is again another skincare brand that is one of my favourites Um, does wonders for the skin so yeah I'm really excited to start using those in the new year because I've run out of everything. I took these from the crackers as well so I thought I'm going to use them next year on Christmas presents because how cute are they? Um, We also have, oh, oh I think um Dean's going out to walk the dogs at me. Bye Dean! <laughs> Oh, it's me the best. Right, okay. 
Right, let me put you back down. Oh, oh sorry, my hair's a bit of a... St I keep touching it, don't I? That's going to annoy so many people, but I... There you go. I feel... <laughs> so, um, yeah, so I was really lucky. Lots of little things in this box. It um, brings me back to when I was a teenager. I used to have Vera Wang Princess, and so my mum got me some. Like, it just brings me back. Let me just... Ah, oh, lovely memories. Do you have a perfume that you kind of brings you back to when you were kind of younger and it just gives you that kind of, what is it called? Melancholy? Mm, no, it's not that. I can't remember what the word is. You're all going to be shouting it at me, but <laughs> it just takes you back and it's really lovely, isn't it? So, also, um, let me just grab got to me she found in the sale which oh I was I was trying to find um but they didn't have the right kind of because I I'm five foot ten so she got me the long size 10 long um jeans from next so I am absolutely obsessed with those and I feel yeah honestly the most thoughtful present giver <laughs> my family are just amazing and Dean like everyone is just so so kind of like thoughtful in their gifts so very lucky and also my favorite in the world my Jack Wills um just leggings basic leggings I use them they are my favorite leggings in the entire world if I had to pick a pair of leggings it would be the Jack Wills ones so comfy they stay up they I love the waistband on them I love this waistband so yeah got those ones which I was very very grateful for um, a little planner, so a little A4, it might be in between A4, no, no, that will, will, will be A4, so an A4 um, weekly planner because I'm obsessed with making lists, planning my week and especially next year when I am going to be doing um, part-time Instagram, YouTube and part-time um, still in my dog grooming salon, so it's going to be very, very busy, so this will come in very handy. <laughs> um, I also... Oh, just to add to that, had a um, candle from when she went to Dubai, she went to, because Bath & Body Works, um, obviously in your, if you're in America, you know how amazing Bath & Body Works is, if you're in the UK, you may not ha um, have heard of it, but they have the most amazing candles in the entire world, oh, it's just amazing, and they last they last really well, they're three wick as well, which I much prefer, um, and the smell is just insane so i was very grateful for that i always whenever we go to america always hunt for a bath and body works um just some little bits as well got some doggy socks which um were adorable because again i'm obsessed with dogs but they have little little poodles on which are so cute um so they're some little stocking fillers and then when i'd done all the presents my dad came in to surprise us all and it's the sweetest thing in the world. And he bought us all um, a wallet. So this is my one, which is so cute. And then he said, open it and inside he put some money, which is, honestly, I can't handle it. <laughs> I cannot handle it. So, oh, that was so thoughtful. Also bought me a book, again, um, anything related to animals, dogs, anything like that. So this one's called Pippa, Little Dog, Big Attitude. Can't wait to read that. So how adorable. So he got those, which honestly melts my heart. Um, and also my grandma also gave me some money and some kind of body lotions and that. And it honestly, sorry about that. My memory card um, decided to say it was full. So I'm going to have to go and purchase another one of those um, on Amazon in a minute. So <laughs> do apologize. It might be a slightly different angle. But I hope you enjoyed this video. I am overwhelmed with the things that I got. Um, I also treated myself to, and it hasn't arrived yet, but a tripod, um, the shoot grip for the Sony camera that I've got. So I'm really excited that's coming on Monday. So I can't wait to start using that. And that was a little sort of Christmas gift to myself because it's gonna be so helpful for next year. Um, I really hope you enjoyed that. As I say, let me know in the comments below, like what was your, what was your favourite thing about Christmas this year? Because, as I say, everybody's is going to be very, very different. And I would love to know, what was your favourite thing um, about Christmas this year? Also, congratulations to my Instagram winner um, of the give giveaway. If you love giveaways, pop over to my Instagram. I do lots and lots over there. Um, and again, I'd love to see you over there. 
So, I hope you had a wonderful day, a wonderful Christmas, and I may or may not be able to do another video before the new year, so um, I will get that, hopefully I'll get that up before the new year. If not, happy new year! <laughs> and let's make 2021 amazing, because we've got to make the most of every situation, and I have a good feeling, I have a good feeling, I think it's going to be a good year, so maybe not to start with, but we'll make the most of it and I promise you we will all get through this. If you're not already subscribed to my channel please um, do that, that would be absolutely amazing and have a wonderful rest of your day. Lots of love, 